Hi guys Bimsara from TechB here. Today I'm gonna show you guys how to install Windows 11 on old hardware. The device I'm gonna use for this is old HP Intel Core i5 3rd gen laptop with 8 gigs of RAM. Before we start can you guys subscribe? That helps me a lot. First I'm gonna show you guys my device is not compatible for Windows 11. Let's open the PC Health Check application which is provided by Microsoft. As you can see, my device is not compatible with Windows 11. Here is my specs again just to make sure. On this device is running on Intel Core i5-3230M processor paired with 8 gigs of RAM. And also I'm using a 120 GB SSD. First you have to download both Windows 11 ISO and Windows 10 ISO. First extract the Windows 10 ISO file which I've already did. Now take a copy of Windows 11 ISO and paste it somewhere else just to make sure. Now open the Windows 11 ISO file from Ultra ISO and go to the source folder. Now search for the appraisers.dll and delete it. Now in the other section go to the Windows 10 folder which we have already extracted. And go to the sources folder and copy the appraisers.dll to Windows 11. Now save it. After it's done use Rufus to create a bootable USB drive. For this I recommend 16 gig pen drive. Install the pen drive and open Rufus. Now select the ISO file which we have created before. If you have old system which doesn't support UEFI boot, try MBR partition scheme. Now click start. This will take some time. Now turn off the device and plug in the bootable USB drive. Now turn on the device. Soon as you hit the power button you need to enter the boot device option. In my case it is F9 key. Or you can also go to startup menu by hitting ESC key and choose from there. So let's go to the boot device option. Select USB hard drive and hit enter. Let's see if it will work or not.
Nope this method won't work for my device. Let's head back to where we stop. Now I'm in current operating system. Plug your bootable USB drive. Let's keep that here for now. Now go to the Windows 10 extracted file. Delete install, ESD file. Select all the other files and copy them to bootable USB drive sources folder and replace them. After completing it shut down the device again. Plug the USB. Open boot device options. boot by USB hard drive. And let's see. Oh yes. Now you can install Windows 11 on your PC. Now I'm gonna install it on my SSD. First format it. Let's let it install. Check the mic and make sure it sound right, boys. That is a massive help for me. Okay, it's installed. Let's go through this real quick.
tell us update drivers. It sound right, boy. It detect updates real fast on Windows Update though. So I'm gonna wind up my video here. If you wanna try this I will leave links down in the description. Do this at your own risk. I'm not taking any responsibility here. As always thanks for watching guys.